3.8 seconds was the lead last time by. It's about Whoa. not making any more mistakes for Colton Herta at this point. was actually off over seven seconds before he made that mistake right. uh, on the last lap, so he, he had that, that big enough pad to survive the mistake. Back to Grosjean back on pit road again. Well, his best finish so far this year, fourth place at uh, St. Pete. Started from the pole to Long Beach. You know what happened there. Had a good go happening. Ended up uh, being in an accident, finished 23rd. Trying to finish the deal today. Two minutes to go. As Colton Herta trying to hold on to it here. Come on, Colton. Here comes Pagano in second. Oh, trouble for Montoya. The oh. nose on that car smashed in. He comes to a rest. Caution. And brings on a full course yellow. With a minute 40 to go, the yellow That's is going to come out for Colton Herta. Will that do it or not? So Colton Herta had just stretched his lead to 5.4 seconds. Montoya involved in an accident. An incident, he has damaged the car. The yellow comes out with a minute 20 to go in this time for race. Wow. So Colton Herta, the 22-year-old, oh so close to having it won here. Wow, that was some significant Six. contact with Montoya. Look at the damage yeah. of that car. Waiting for a replay on that. He must have spun around and got the outside wall between I believe and over one and two. Here comes a replay. Montoya out of the car. He's okay. Yeah, he's already hit it. He already hit something there. He's already damaged coming through. Turn 11. Looks like he must have hit something in turn 11. Yeah, coming off the Left inside of the car was damaged. Coming off the infield up onto the, the short shoot of the oval there would be the most likely place he caught a pretty good uh, shot of the outside wall to do that kind of damage. Well, here comes Colton Herta, about to make a ride to victory lane, isn't he? The 22-year-old. With a great move by his team early on, here's the white flag coming out for Colton Herta, the 22-year-old of California. Woo! Having his moment in the rain at Indy. Not in the sun, it's in the rain. Full well, wow, this race has had just about everything, every twist and turn that you could ask for. Very cool. With the weather conditions, with the tire strategies, with uh, some of the different things that have happened along the way to make the story of this one a long one. But uh, through it all, we know one thing. Colton Herta had a fast race car, and uh, none of it faced it. No. Nope, so Colton Hurt on his way to Victory Lane, and guess what? We're going to have more racing for you. Who cares if it's raining, right? Indy Lights is going to be coming out in about 30 minutes. But let's celebrate with Colton Hurt, who's to the backstretch right now, waiting to take the checkered flag. And it'd be, there's Dixon rolling around. What a job by all these teams today, huh? Dixon 10th. And what a, what a job of persevering. Oh. Dixon started back in 21st place. Remember, was caught a lap down after he ran out of fuel, trying to stretch it to get uh, hopefully catch a caution and get back on the lead lap. And uh, it finally worked out for him, and they've come back through, and Dixon is going to get a top 10 out of this one. And you got to feel for Colton Herta, everything he's been through this year with the races, and uh, finishing the job today under very, very tough conditions. Colton Herta is over in turn number 11. The pace car out there as the yellow's out. Final couple of quarters, and it will be another victory for Colton Herta. He finished a runner-up here at the Speedway in the Harvest Grand Prix back in the 2020, but he's going to be one step higher on the podium this time as he comes off the final corner and will come to the line for his fifth win in the NTT IndyCar Series. And here he is. Let's salute the champion who gets it done today. The GMR Grand Prix winner is Colton Herta. Woo! Twin checkered flags wave. Congratulations yeah. to 
Colton Herta getting it done as the team celebrates Sandretti Autosport with Curb Agajanian down there. A big day in the rain at Indy. He did it. Pagano second, Will Power third, Erickson in fourth, Connor Daly in fifth. And let's remember the key moment that set this whole day in motion. Now, any lights will be on track. 